Good evening, everyone, and thanks for joining us tonight. New Iberia residents are speaking out after a so-called riot after the Sugarcane Festival this past weekend. To get you caught up, Saturday night, this video was recorded as people were leaving the festivities. It shows Iberia Parish deputies using what many residents called excessive force in trying to get people to leave. Three people were placed under arrest. Tonight, one deputy is on administrative leave. And our Stephen Albritton joining us live in studio. And Stephen, what did those arrested have to say about all of this? Marcel, they say although it was crowded, everyone was moving down the street like police said to do. But then everything changed. Saturday night's events are described as a riot by the Iberia Parish Sheriff's Office. But the focus was on how deputies handled crowd control when festivities ended. Police soon started making arrests. I was passing by with one of my friends and saw a relative and I was asking him if he was okay so I could have contact one of his family members and the officer grabbed me. The Daedria Moore says she was thrown to the ground and on the hood of a police car, suffering neck, back and shoulder injuries. Everyone was just having a good time, like nobody was doing nothing bad or anything. Everybody was just doing what they regularly do on Sugar Cane Festival. In the arrest report, deputies say Moore resisted arrest after refusing to move from the street. She says she's surprised at the details in the report. I was not resisting arrest. She started arresting me after I said, Chris, are you okay? So I was going to call somebody. That's what said, but I did not say that. David Harden is accused of starting the riot. He had a similar reaction when seeing the report. Herbert Harden stated that he had attorneys for you. They were on you. Oh, Lord, I don't even talk like that. Deputies say Harden said not to touch him or he would, quote, crush them. And that's when he was arrested. Harden says he is innocent of the crime and looks forward to having his name cleared. I took my name down to the curb. They made me look like a really bad person, man. That's not me. I got a family I'm raising here. There's no way. I tell my son about bad decisions every day. There's no way that he would have to worry about me ever in that situation. Many residents in the Hopkins Street area believe what happened Saturday night was racially motivated. The Iberia Parish Sheriff's Office declined comment as the investigation continues. Live in studio, Stephen Albritton, KTC TV3.